Sometimes, if you want those abs to pop, you gotta walk by that cookie platter. Here's the thing. We all spend far too much time sitting down. It is one of the biggest causes of lower back pain. No need to worry about that today because we're gonna do an amazing standing ab routine. You're gonna do five moves back to back for 60 seconds a piece without laying down or sitting once. You ready to get after it? Come on, let's get shredded. First move, you're gonna stand with your feet hip width apart, raise your right arm up to the sky. These are extended toe touches. Think about it as like a standing V up. So extend that right foot out behind you. Nice big hinge back at the hip and the shoulder. And from here, you're gonna crunch it down and bring it out. You're gonna do 30 seconds on one side, then we're gonna switch and do 30 seconds on the other. After that, we roll right in to the preceding moves. So just try to stay with me. You're gonna need one dumbbell for this exercise, so keep it, keep it close by. All right, let's hinge it back, reach it back in three, two, one, collapse it. Crunch it down, bring it out. That's a beautiful. Really contract that core. You should be feeling this. No momentum on this. All your abs. Beautiful. Nice full contraction to extension. I want you to think about that hip joint and shoulder joint like hinges. Beautiful. Come on, you only have 12 seconds left, and then we're switching sides. Pick up that pace a little bit. Beautiful. Keep that belly button pulled in and up. Core nice and tight. Crunch it down. Woo! And switch, other side. Reach it up, step it back, contract that core, extend it out. All that weight sunk into that right heel, open it out wide, crunch it down tight. Beautiful. Again, thinking about those joints like hinges. Beautiful, that's it. Come on, only 10 seconds left. Let's pick it up. Five seconds, we're almost there. Three, two, one. Muay ties. Point that left toe out. Take those right fingertips up to the sky. I want you to imagine that you're picking a coconut from way up high. Grab a hold of it and then crash it down to the outside of that left thigh and hit it. Whole key with this is to make sure that you're really turning through that torso, contracting those left obliques. Beautiful. Make it powerful, full extension. This does not count. Full extension through the toe and the hands. Crunch it down nice and strong, like you're smashing that coconut. Come on, only seven seconds left. Pick it up. Keep that belly button pulled in and up. Two, one, switch. Other side immediately, no rest. Take it right out, full extension. If you don't like the coconut metaphor, Feel free to pretend that it's my head. Just smash it. Uh, come on, full extension. Really rotating that torso. Only 12 seconds left. Come on, pick it up. Six seconds. Staying strong. Full extension. Two, one. Taking it right into a windmill. For this one, you're gonna step wide, turn those toes out to the left, pop that booty out, that right hip turns out. Right hand up to the sky, left hand on the inner thigh, and you're gonna take that hand, trace all the way down to your ankle, and then come back up. Three, two, one, hit it. Down, back up. If you want to make this a little harder, you can do it holding dumbbells. But this is a great place to start. Really keep that right arm up so that the wrist is directly over the shoulder. Come down as far as your flexibility will allow. If this is the extent of your range of motion, that's cool. But if you get all the way down, go for it. Come on, only five seconds on this side. Two, one, switch. Other side, arm up, take it down. Beautiful. Sometime, sometimes you have to realize that life works out better when you sacrifice the short-term pleasure for a long-term gain. And the unfortunate truth about that is sometimes you want those abs to pop, you gotta walk by that cookie platter. You're at your office, there's a cookie tray in the conference room. Just gotta keep on trucking. Just think, you want those abs popping. And done with those. Now that's not to say 
don't enjoy your life fully, I want you to enjoy your life to its extent. But the simple fact of the matter is, go for the highest quality version of the things that you want. You want that cookie? Don't grab that crappy ass cookie off the office conference tray. You know they're no good. Save it up for that beautiful, delicious, homemade, ooey gooey chocolate chip cookie that you want so badly. Then it's worth it. All right, move number five. This is a static dumbbell hold. This is gonna build that deep inner core that's gonna keep your postural alignment nice and tall, those abs pulled in nice and tight. All the other moves are gonna help work all the angles of that six pack. This is gonna th keep your posture in alignment. So for this, grab a hold of that dumbbell, get a nice tight grip, draw the shoulders down the back, hold it out at shoulder level, and hit it. This is it, ladies. You and me, holding this dumbbell for 60 seconds, just like this. Keep that belly button pulled in and up, shoulders down the back. I want you to take all of this work into your core. I don't want you to feel this in your shoulders. Of course, you're gonna feel it in your shoulders, but I want the emphasis of this to be in your core, total stability. Transverse abdominis, that's what you're working right now. Quick bio 101 lesson. <laughs> now I was saying to you, sometimes it's important to sacrifice that short-term pleasure for a long time gain. Well, a perfect story about that. When I was little, I have a huge, huge family, as you know, and my Italian family likes to give cash for presents. I have no idea. I think it's an Italian thing. But every year growing up, I would get, you know, cash in an envelope from my uncles and aunts, and my mom would take it every single birthday. She'd take the cash and she'd give me like five bucks, and I would throw a fit. Like, that's my money. I want to go spend it on garbage, who knows, up in town. And she just said to me, she said, you know, just trust me, Adam. One day you're going to thank me. I'm teaching you the value of saving. And so, lo and behold, when I turned 16 years old, I went out and bought my first car in cash. So thank you, Mom. Sacrificing that short-term gain for a long-time goal. It was a beautiful lesson. You could apply it to your fitness. You could apply it to your life. Come on, we only have five seconds left. Three, two, one, and down. If you needed to take a break during that 60 seconds just to let your shoulders air out, it's totally cool. You wanna work up to a place where you're able to hold that out for 60 seconds without flinching. All right, this is the last move. You know it wouldn't be complete without a high intensity finisher, right? Exactly. Hiding under those layers of fat are your abs. The only way to reveal them is by sending your heart rate through the roof and burning that fat off. So let's do this together. We're gonna do what I call stick-ups. We're gonna raise our fingers to the sky, draw the shoulders down the back, and run high knees in place for 60 seconds. Going as fast as you can, resting only if and when you need. Stay with me, I'm gonna be right here with you. Come on, enough talk, let's do this. We got three, two, one, let's hit it. Remember, this is a sprint, not a marathon, so you go nice and hard. Not a jog, baby, it's a sprint. Fingertips to the sky, shoulders down the back, pumping those knees, keeping those abs racked out. Should feel a nice stretch in the torso right now. Nice tight abs, keep that belly button pulled in and up. Nice deep breaths, come on, come on, come on, finish it strong. You're only doing one round of these. Go hard, 30 seconds, we're halfway there, come on, move. Keep those elbows in line with the ears. 25 seconds, we're more than halfway there, stay with it. Come on, high knees, high knees, high knees. Soften the feet, soften the ankles. Come on, you got this. I'm right here with you, don't give up. Do not give up, stay with me. Come on, 13 seconds, we're almost there. That's it, that's it, 10 seconds. Come on, kick on the afterburners, push. Double time, we got six, five, four, three, two, one, done. Woo, five moves, six pack. a girl, I'll catch you next time. These shorts, C9 by Target. I love them, they're nice and functional. We got that little pop of color there on the side just to keep things spicy. These sneakers, also C9. Nice and classic, support me through any workout.